Ladies and gentlemen, it is the most electrifying host on social media. That is right, it is Team Rai Rai. I am back. Is that freaking great or what? Now, let me do my quick introduction, then we go from there. It is time to get this amazing podcast underway. And once again, I'm going to discuss wrestling news, wrestling topics, and a lot of interesting topics to discuss with you. So sit back, relax, put your feet up, grab whatever you want to eat, grab whatever you want to drink, because this will be a very interesting topic to discuss on the awesome Team Rai Rai's podcast edition. So here goes nothing. Now back in November, of 2017 that possibility that Raw and SmackDown Live might go to a different um, brand, you know, a different network. So hopefully that happens, okay? If you have not listened to that one back in November, go listen to it. Now here's another report, okay? That um, if they go to Fox Sports Net, or I forgot how they used to call it. Well, actually, they used to call it Fox Sports Net. Now they call it Fox. If they do that for Raw, guess what? They will automatically go for two hours, back to two hours, from 8 to 10. I guess it all depends on the time zone. No more three hours. Thank freaking God. Hopefully, um, Fox makes a great deal what do we and they can't pass it up now if that happens um they're gonna drop ufc to sign raw hopefully that happens and if they do happens then smack alive will go to a uh, fox s f1 something like that i can't really picture i don't know if it's gonna be on tuesday night still i'm um, hopefully so i'll put the latest information i'll put you guys the the link because it's a the it'll be the the article plus the guy says it on Twitter. So so they're focused on, on their contract does not expire until September of 2019, but they can still talk about it. But USA wants them on network, on not network, on USA network because they love how their show runs, but three hours is a buzzkill. Two hours it is plenty of time. So, Raw would be going back to two hours if the pro pro I mean pro I mean program moved to Fox in 2019 when a WWE contract with NBA Universe expires. So that is pretty awesome. Hopefully, it does happen. You know, maybe more we're all get more popular. I don't know, but. They won't go to the three hours because they have um, sports news after that. Maybe it was discussed Raw after Raw. That'd be kind of cool. So hopefully this happens. If not, then probably USA is going to probably find a way to resign them. Then it, it will still be a three hour Raw. Now, I know some of these employees, they don't mind it if it's three hours or two hours, but face facts. Is getting very boring, very dull. I still watch it regardless, you know. But if it ever goes to the Fox Sports, do you think some of these old school wrestling fans will go back to watching it? Probably not. They give up in it because they're doing some garbage shit. Sarah Malinger's garbage crap on Raw. But let's see what happens. So maybe they will make a deal before 2019, but they can't move until 2019 <clears throat> but they, yeah they can do nothing until the contract expires because they're still part of the NBA Universal uh, expires so the contract so it's not the NBA of basketball I guess it's another format maybe I'm right maybe I'm wrong so like subscribe favorite leave a comment with this article and we love to see Raw go on to Fox and then Smackdown go to Fox SF1. Something that would be kind of neat. If you don't have it, then probably you could download the app. 
I know some of you still want Raw and SmackDown on the W Network. They should by now. They do, but it's a couple of weeks, episodes late, you know. They should always have it on the network. This is the 21st century already, W. Come on now. So let's see what happens. I'll keep you guys updated and any more news. So have a good rest of your Friday and have a great weekend. This is the host here. Sign off. It is Team RA. Thank you very much for listening. This is Team RA. It's sign off. Ciao, ciao.